Hello mga kadonat! Have a glorious day to all of you. And shout out to all our old and new subscribers, likers, and viewers. Welcome to the OTB channel or also known as the online teacher blog. This is Teacher Al. And let's have a trivia fun facts about owls. Did you know? There are over 200 different species of all living among us. They have binoculars, vision, envious hearing, and excellent posture. Owls feed on rodents, small mammals, fish, and other birds. The burrowing owl is one of the smallest species of owl. And that's for our trivia owl of the day so let's have the topic that we will discuss today this is entitled what is upset how many items are the questions and what are the upset exam coverage and duration and this is our precious topic of the day and of course mga kadonat please click the subscribe button below like and share so let's start now with what is upset. Interested to join the military? Upset is the first part of the application and recruitment process. It is mandatory for applicants to take this exam regardless of what branch of AFB such as Army, PATH, or Philippine Air Force, Navy, Marines you decide to enter. What is upset? And how many items are the questions and what are the absent exam coverage? Armed Forces of the Philippine Service Aptitude Test is the meaning of absent, and it consists of 150 items questions. The coverage includes abstract reasoning, verbal reasoning, and numerical reasoning. What are the absent exam duration? Each subject has a duration of 30 minutes, which means the exam will take you 1 hour and 30 minutes to finish. So what are the ABSAT exam coverage? So this includes abstract reasoning, verbal reasoning, and numerical reasoning, which will be discussed in the next page. Abstract reasoning. The abstract reasoning measures the ability to see the relationships among things rather than among words and numbers. Next is the verbal reasoning. The verbal reasoning measures the ability to reason and solve problems through the concept of words by complete comprehension, grammar, and vocabulary recognition. And lastly, we have numerical reasoning. The numerical reasoning measures the ability to solve mathematical problems. Alright, so I think that's all for our topic of the day, mga kadonat. And thank you so much for watching and hope you've learned a lot from our topic of the day. And of course, mga kadonat, please don't forget to click the subscribe button below like and share this is again the online teacher blog and saying jesus is the captain of our salvation from hebrews chapter 2 verse 10 to the captain of our salvation jesus christ be all be all the honor glory and majesty and adoration and it's time to say goodbye now have a wonderful day. God bless. Bye.